Hello and welcome to Play With Me, Toys for Kids. Today I'm going to be showing you this pudding set and we'll be baking the pudding together. This is a little bit interesting because we're actually going to be making the pudding mold of a bottom. That's right, a buttocks. So here on the front we have Chin Chan with a dog. His dog's name is Lucky. And we're going to be making the figures of Chin Chan's face, Lucky's face, and then also Chin Chan's butt. So I find this set both hilarious and very strange. I think it'd be pretty funny to serve this to a friend, see what they say. So as you can see, we'll be creating his bottom from pudding. And it looks quite delicious, I have to say. We'll also be creating the dog, like I said. All of the instructions are in Japanese, but luckily photos are included as well. So it should be pretty easy to figure out. This looks a lot like a pop and cook and set, but it isn't one. It's a little bit different. So in addition to the set, we're also going to need a microwave, a bowl, and some milk. Let's go ahead and start by seeing what's inside. First up we have a mold. As you can see, one of them is the bottom of Chin Chan. The other one is the face of Chin Chan, and the other one is the face of his dog Lucky. Next we have a pink packet. as well as an orange packet. The orange packet will be used to make the pudding and the pink to make a sauce which goes with the pudding. So we are actually going to be making this together today, so stay tuned. First I need to go get some milk and then we're going to go ahead and get started. So as you can see, here in the photos, it looks like the orange packet will be mixed with 100 milliliters of milk, put in the microwave, and then into the mold. And then later, we will mix milk with the pink packet and make sauce for our pudding. I have to say this looks delicious and I'm already getting hungry, so let's go ahead and get started and 100 milliliters of milk plus the orange packet Voila! And I'm going to stir this together really, really well before microwaving it. Then I'm going to microwave it for 30 seconds to 1 minute. And we'll see what happens after that. So I've microwaved it for around 45 seconds, it smells really really good, and all the powder is mixed in with the milk, it smells a lot like vanilla pudding, and it looks pretty delicious as well. We're ready to let it cool, but first we need to put it into the molds, and then I'll be putting it into the fridge overnight. So there we have it. I'm going to carefully take this to the fridge, and luckily you guys don't have to wait overnight. We'll return in one minute. While I'm doing this, I'm going to go ahead and make the pink sauce. So it looks like this is a sauce which goes on the bottom of the plate, and then we'll put the pudding on the top. And we don't need the microwave for this, we just need a small cup or bowl, as well as more milk. So it's off to the fridge with the pudding, and then we'll be making the sauce for our pudding, and maybe I'll even try it out today. It does smell very, very delicious. So here I've let this cool overnight, 
As you can see, it's become the perfect consistency of pudding. I'm now going to try to put it onto this plate here without wrecking it. It seems like it's pretty stuck in there. So next I'm going to try it with a spoon, but very, very carefully to make sure I don't ruin it. Since this doesn't seem to be working, I'm now going to take a toothpick and go around the whole thing until it comes out. There we go. So that seemed to work a lot better. Here's our first figure, Lucky the dog, and as you can see it turned out really, really well. Next up I'm going to take out Chin Chan's bottom. And there we go, plop, there we go. As you can see it really does look like a bottom. I find this one really funny and I would love to serve this to a friend and see what they say. And finally we have Chin Chan. This one seems to be a little bit more difficult to get out. There we go. So here are our three figures, Chin Chan's bottom, Lucky the dog, and Chin Chan. I have to say that my favorite one so far is definitely Chin Chan's bottom. But first we're going to make some pudding and then it will finally be done. Or sorry, the sauce for the pudding. So I have here a small cup and I'm going to start by pouring the package in. Oops. And next I have some milk. I'm not going to measure this, I'm just going to do it by feel. There we go. And I'm going to mix this up really, really well. This smells a lot like strawberries, so I think it's kind of a strawberry sauce for vanilla pudding. I'm going to put this in the center of the plate, and then I'll go ahead and put the pudding on top. So we'll start with Chin Chan's bottom. Lucky the dog. Ooh, they seem to be pretty stuck to the plate. Oh, and Chin Chan's dog. Lucky already has some pudding all over his face. But that's okay. I'm sure it's tasty. And there we have Chin Chan. So as you can see, it really does look like the packaging. I have to say that this turned out really well and I'm pretty excited to try out how it tastes. This was a fun project and like I said, I would love to serve it to a friend and see what they say. I personally think it'd be pretty funny to be served a pudding bottom. But anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up down below. In the comments, let me know if you would ever eat pudding that was shaped like a bottom. And go check out the channel. Be sure to subscribe for the newest videos and updates. Hope to see you all next time. Bye!